Hey, just a super quickie. It's uh, 12 days before my surgery. I have my bags. I'm packing three bags. I have one small bag just for the hospital, which I should only be in one night. I have the second bag that is stuff I'll need for Linda's, which is the next two days, the first two days out of the hospital. And then my bigger bag, which will be stuff that I'll need at Sal's, where I'm going to be for the rest of the week until my one week follow-up appointment with the doctors, and then I'll go home. Um, something I had ordered, I heard a couple people mention them, they're the two ounce portion cups with little plastic cups with the lids. Um, people use them for jello shots or for condiments or whatever, but I figure for making jello, not jello shots, but jello, uh, once I'm allowed to eat it, these will be good. And basically for anything else, actually, starting off just not wanting to put too big a portion in front of myself, that having the two ounce cups was probably a good idea. And also that way if I make something, I'm probably going to be making more than two ounces of it at a time, and this way I can divide it out into the cups and put it in the fridge or freezer, however it needs to go. These were about $10 on Amazon, and... That's, I think, the only news. Otherwise, everything's on. Had my blood drawn, what, yesterday, day before, for my uh, pre-op blood work. And uh, getting nervous. I am getting more nervous. This morning on the countdown calendar, when I scheduled the number 12, I got chills. Like, I actually got chills. And I was like, okay, we've gone from, like, 90% excited, 10% nervous to like, this morning I was feeling more like 60% excited, 40% nervous. I guess that's just gonna, you know, get more nervous as the surgery gets closer because face it, surgery sucks. It hurts. Well, you're not awake for it, but waking up from it hurts and recovering from it hurts. And I'm just hoping I'm one of those lucky folks who has a totally smooth recovery period, doesn't have problems getting their water down, doesn't have problems swallowing initially, and as long as that's the case, it should be awesome. Um, well, awesome is a strong word. I'm trying to have a positive outlook, <laughs> but feeling, uh, having had my share of surgery, you, you never feel awesome uh, post-operatively, really, for anything, but I'm hoping that this will go as smoothly as possible. Just trying to stay really positive. And that's really it for, uh, for now.